The topic for today is how to uninstall 3DS Max 2026. Let's search for the control panel. Click on the control panel. Click on the uninstall program. Let's maximize the window. Here you can see the multiple 3DS Max components installed during installation. For identifying the 3DS Max components, check the publisher and install date. Next, click on Emax DUA for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. After clicking, it will continue the uninstallation process. Next, click on Autodesk USD for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. After clicking, it will continue the uninstallation process. Next, click on Adobe Substance 3D for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. After clicking, it will continue the uninstallation process. Next, click on Autodesk Advanced Modeling Tools for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. Let's click on the Retopology tool for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. Next, click on the Flow Retopology tool for 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. After clicking, it will continue the uninstallation process. Next, click on Autodesk Access. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, it will prepare for uninstallation. When the preparation is complete, click on Uninstall. After clicking, it will start the uninstallation process. After uninstallation, click Finish. Next, click on Autodesk 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, it will start preparing for uninstallation. After preparation, it will show you all the 3DS Max components that are going to be uninstalled. Click on Uninstall. After clicking it, it shows 3DS Max 2026 currently running in the background. So for the time being, click on Cancel. Next, click on Autodesk Identity Manager. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, you will see the background unfinished uninstallation progress message appear. Don't worry, just click OK and wait for some time to finish the background process. Press right click and click Refresh. Again, click on the Autodesk Identity Manager. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, a confirmation window will appear. Click Yes. After clicking, it will continue the uninstallation process. After successful uninstallation, a confirmation window will appear. Click OK. Here you can see after uninstallation, a system restart message appeared. Let's restart the system. After restarting the system, click on Autodesk 3DS Max 2026. Click on Uninstall. After clicking, it will start preparing for uninstallation. After initialization, it will show you all the 3DS Max components that are going to be uninstalled. Click on Uninstall. This 3DS Max software is large in size and may take a little bit of time to uninstall based on your PC configuration, so be patient. Let's fast forward this portion. After successful uninstallation, a confirmation message will appear. Click Finish. You can see that after uninstallation, 3DS Max 2026 is still visible. Let's click Refresh. Here you can see all the balance components installed are essential components for Autodesk software, which does not require uninstallation. So in this process, you can do an Autodesk 3DS Max 2026 clean uninstallation. Like, subscribe, share, and press the bell icon for more interesting topics.